Scientists are testing a combination of two anti-HIV drugs taken as pills once a week. I asked Dr. Amy Colson what difference this could make to people living with HIV. What are the most important findings from this study? Yeah, so this was a really exciting study. It looked at a novel combination of Islatravir and Lenacapavir as weekly oral therapy. The weekly oral combination was compared to Victegravir and Tricytabine, Tenofovir, Elefenamide in virologically suppressed individuals. And what the study showed is one, the combination worked, it worked well. Two, it was well tolerated. There were no serious adverse events. There were no grade three or grade four adverse events. And finally, there was no impact on CD4 count or absolute lymphocyte count in the Islatravir than a Capavir arm. And so why was there a concern about uh, CD4 count in lymphocytes? Yeah, prior Islatravir studies with higher doses have shown dose-dependent declines in CD4 count and absolute lymphocyte count. So there was a concern that maybe we'd see this again. Mm -hmm. So using lenacapavir and islatravir, why are these two good to use together? So the drugs have another number of common features. So they're both potent at very low doses. They both have long half-lives compatible with weekly oral dosing. And they both have novel mechanisms of action and novel resistance profiles. So they represent a, a good coupling for a trial of a once weekly oral regimen. And for, for, the, for the people with HIV that you treat, what difference would a weekly uh, oral regimen make? Right, so some people with HIV don't mind at all taking a pill every day, but some people really do. They really don't like it. They don't like thinking about their HIV. They don't like having to remember to take a pill every day. And for those people, I think a weekly option would represent a, a you know, really an improvement in the quality of their life.